Hello everybody, welcome back. This is Jay Mack with On The Snap. Uh, I'm gonna go through shot number three on the critical, on the 99 critical shots pull. This one is the center ball follow shot. So the idea behind this one is that um, basically straight in on the pocket, still hitting center ball at about the same speed as I hit the last shot. Uh, the last shot because the cue ball was so close to the object ball. Um, it didn't have time to overcome uh, the skid on the table. Uh, so by the time it hit, it was not rolling forward nor backward, and it would just stop in place. Uh, this time, the, the object ball and cue ball will be further apart, same speed. It will overcome that friction. Uh, the friction will overcome the slide, and it'll start rolling forward. And after it hits, hopefully, uh, it will get in line with the object ball in the corner pocket. Uh, hopefully, because uh, I may not be able to do it. Not consistently, at least, but that's the idea of it. Uh, so again, hitting Mr. Rempy in the face, uh, probably about 18 inches here, two feet. On a nine foot table, it'd be a little easier to get a long roll. Um, about the same speed, center ball hit, hitting Mr. Rempy in the face, about the same speed as last time. Overheat it by just a hair, not much. And it rolled forward uh, to give me a good shot on the next ball. So I'll do uh, probably about 20 of these and uh, get your idea, see how, how much I can get in dead, in the, uh, dead in shape. So same speed before, pause, pause, stroke. You see the ball roll forward. For a little too much, so I'm hitting it a little too hard. Seems like it shouldn't be the case, but I am. Center ball, no follow, no draw, center ball. You can see it roll forward, even though I'm hitting center ball, same, about the same speed as I was the last time. Just in the face. Goes forward. I'm going to line it up where you can see the red lines this time to see if I hit it straight. Watch the cue ball able to roll straight through. Center ball. See, I rolled it off to the left a little bit that time. Still leaving good shots, probably because of my trying to focus on you guys and the shot. So center. There we go. Rolling, over rolling it just a little bit. A little bit of speed off. There we go. Still getting a little bit extra roll than I want. You guys are experiencing this pretty much real time for me. I've looked at these shots. I don't know if I've spent a lot of time on them or not. Set the ball, pause, pause. See how it rolled forward beautifully there? That one was just about perfect. Chalk up, got about a minute and a half left on this one. Down the shot, pause, pause, stroke. Now I'm feeling it like I'm a little bit better in stroke here. Down on it, line it up, pause, pause, stroke. See it rolling right up nicely for that, that next shot. Ball, pause at the ball, pause the backstroke, stroke it through. Rolling nicely now, rolling nicely now. Got four or five shots here. Set a ball, pause at the at address, pause at the backstroke, stroke through. Just roll it up for your next shot. Address, pause at the ball. Pause the backstroke, follow through. You can see it, you can, on that one you can see it slide pretty well. Uh, this will be the last one. Pocket's pretty full, I don't know, I'm gonna have to go over there and get them and then try to reset. So, down on it, center ball, pause at the address, pause at the backstroke, follow through. Until I hit that one a little harder because it skidded further and didn't quite get enough of the roll through. So, that's uh, shot three. Uh, we've got 96 more to go, so I appreciate it. Remember to like, subscribe, 
Uh, hit the notification bell. I'm J Mac with On The Snap, and I'm out of here. Hit them well.